So I'm François Cadou from Parrot. I'm the project manager of the Bebop drone. So what are you guys showing here new at CES with your drone line? So we're showing here is the Bebop drone. It's the new drone we released in December. Uh, it's a really small and light drone. It's only weight 400 grams, so it's really safe and secure. Uh, what is brand new is that we have a 180 degree uh, front camera. So you can take pictures of 180 degrees or you can have uh, the video recorded. Uh, it's only an 80 degree uh, 1080p video. So uh, in fact, we can stabilize it since we have a wide angle camera. When the drone is tilting, uh, we can uh, stabilize the video. So you can do great footage traveling like in the movies. And, uh, so it's, and it's really easy to fly. And it's a really nice uh, product. So how have the last five years helped you develop robotics technology to come to the consumer level? Uh, in fact, uh, what we do in parts is that uh, we take uh, consumer uh, sensors like gyros, etc., uh, that you have in the in the mobile phone, for, for example. But we use it in a more uh, specific way to make it fly. We know uh, we develop how to to know the tilt and the uh, of the drone. We also have a vertical camera. It's also a camera from smartphones, and so it's uh, it's filming the the ground. And we suppose that uh, everything that we see in the camera is the is the movement of the drone. So it, it makes it able. We are able to have the 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 speed of the drone with this. And also for the the front camera to stabilize it, uh, we have to synchronize uh, the the video with the the gyros, and then we compensate the movement of this uh, of the of the drone to the to the video to to make it uh, really stable. We also have a uh, we also com compensate the, the wobble. Uh, in fact, the, the cameras are uh, acquiring line by line. So when there is vibration, uh, some lines can be uh, not at the same level. So with the gyro, we fit that uh, to be straight and uh, good looking. So what do you think it is about the drone craze that's been happening in the last few years in the Americas? So I mean, it's uh, it's a dream for for everyone to fly at the beginning. Like uh, you you know how to fly, uh, you 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 see you think you're flying, and uh, and here with the bebop and uh, the sky controller, it's a remote control. You can plug in uh, glasses to have the the live video feedback on, on glasses, and so you really have the first person view experience. So it's like you're flying, in fact. So it's really fun, and uh, you you it's uh, it's a dream for everyone to be. So talk about little how you're implementing VR goggles and such to your drone technology and your software. So in fact, you have the uh, with the Bebop, you have over Wi-Fi the live video streaming of the of the drone, and so with the Sky Controller, you can plug in uh, through USB or HDMI any glasses, so you have the live video feedback from the from the Bebop, and also when they have gyros, and then you can have the 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 head movements, and so we can move the camera like you're moving the head, and uh, so it's really like your bird, in fact. Now, will this work with Oculus Rift? Do you have to use your own VR peripherals for it to work? Uh, it doesn't work yet with the Oculus Rift, but it's compatible with all everything that has uh, HDMI or USB for now. Any plans to make it compatible with Oculus Rift? Yeah, sure, we, we want to do it, yeah. <laughs> so, um, last thing, talk about, uh, for someone who knows nothing about drones, What's their best course of action to start getting into buying them and flying them? With the Bebop, in fact, it's really easy to use. We made it very, very easy. The, all the sensors that we have is to make uh, f the flight very easy. You just press one button, then it takes off. And so you can start playing around, uh, not go too high, or just do it in your backyard and film yourself. And uh, afterwards, when you're getting more confident, you can go further and have better shots. Uh, when will the Bebop come out, if it's not already out, and how much will it be? So it's already in the market in the U.S. since December, and it's uh, $4.99.